Hi, welcome to the Math Smarts PD blog. We're here to talk about triangular flashcards and how they could be used to take a little bit different angle approach on learning your basic facts. So we have an example of a addition subtraction flashcard. And here we could see using addition we have 7 plus 8 would give us a sum of 15. And here's a multiplication division flashcard. Six groups of eight equals 48, or six times eight equals 48. So how could these be used to help build my fluency with basic facts? Well, we can look at our addition subtraction. Thinking of the inverse relationship between addition and subtraction, say I covered up the eight. If I knew seven plus something gives me a total of 15, I could either use a counting up strategy or I could relate it to subtraction and think 15 minus 7 would give me 8. eight. <laughs> Same thing with our multiplication and division. I could either use it to practice my multiplication facts. 6 times 8 would give me 48. 48. Thank you, Leslie. Or I could relate it to division and cover up one of my factors. So if I knew 8 groups of something equals 48. That is basically the same thing as thinking 48 divided by 8 would be 6. Thank you, Liz. So those are just a few different ways that you can use your basic facts triangular flashcards.